Hello YouTube, I got this uh, 100,000 BTU walk burner from uh, eBay. This is made in Taiwan. And uh, let's see how it works. So, oh yeah, lots of power, lots of heat. You can't see the flame because it's uh, day daylight. It's all blue flame, very hot. I also got this uh, handmade Chinese wok. It's made in China. Oh, I got it from Amazon. It's made from Zhang Zhangqiu, China. It's supposedly handmade, hand forged steel. It has to be uh, pounded. Uh, 36,000 times to make this uh, this walk. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, season it. In Chinese, that means uh, let's say that means kai guo before I start using it. So I'm going to heat it up on this. This walk, walk burner. I'm gonna turn it on real high. So I'm gonna just heat it up. And then I'll put some oil, I'll put some uh, canola oil. You can use any kind of vegetable oil. That's all I have, so. Nice weather today, not much view. So this is just a regular propane tank. down a little bit. Don't want to crack it. So this is made in uh, Taiwan. You should do this outdoors. By the way, when you do this, make sure you put a couple of concrete tiles underneath because it gets pretty damn hot. You don't want to damn any, anything, including your nice tile. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes and I'm gonna turn off the heat, let it cool down, then I'm gonna use uh, oil. Don't want to put oil on hot pan like this. It can catch on fire. So turn it off. Let it cool down before I put oil on it and then heat it up again. So I put oil on it. I'll heat up. Be careful. Okay I have a coated I coated pan with oil all over. Yeah. Canola oil, canola oil. I'm just heating it up. Let it smoke. So now I'm just using uh, low heat. Let it heat up, let it smoke and then let it cool a little bit and then wipe some more oil and just repeat you see it started turning black it's 
so that are kind of blacken evenly she's smoking that's my already rag make sure you dispose of that safely wiping it with already rag don't burn yourself Repeatedly coating it with an oily rag, canola oil, and then wipe it, and then uh, heat it. Low heat. Concentrating on places, spots that haven't been uh, blackened. So I found that thin coating of oil works the best. Just wipe it on there and let it, let it smoke. When you use a thin coating, it won't leave streaks. Wipe it. Keep doing this, let it smoke and then smear another thin coating on it. All over the pan, both inside and outside. Repeat until the degree of blackness is to your satisfaction. So after about 45 minutes, I'm pretty happy with the result. A little blotchiness over there, I don't know why. But it's pretty, pretty nice. I'm gonna let it cool down, and then I'm gonna wash it with hot water. The next step is cooking on it. So. This is my setup, wok, burner, zhangqiu wok, and I'm going to try to make some uh, stir-fried uh, shrimp, butterfly shrimp, with uh, snow pea. The ingredients are snow pea, Butterfly the uh, shrimp, I uh, marinated with some uh, rice wine, salt, uh, ginger, and uh, egg white, and some uh, cornstarch. Ginger, green onion, salt, rice wine, and white pepper. Also oil, I got this uh, avocado oil. So let's give it a try, turn on the heat. Cool oil, that'll heat up. Oh, no, yeah. That should be enough. Huh? Let it heat up. Oh shit, I'm bouncy bouncy with the tongue. Yang. I should have put that in there. Okay. There you go. Now let's have a taste. My other food. Mm. Delicious. Thank you for watching.